Hello guys, this is Deepak from Badra Electronics. Today I got one more commercial ECU. In this week, I will going to show you how to do this repair service for the vehicle. Actually, I got this ECU from the customer directly. He is not even give a single report. Why? Because he already scanned the vehicle, but he not even get a single phone call. For this type of complaint, what will be the solution? I am here to give a solution for you all guys. But I concluded this complaint in the hardware is only from the software issue. In this board, we are not having a single issue from the hardware. In this vehicle, we clearly got an information that this was having some data corrupt inside the hardware. So for that reason, today we will fix by data. So let's see how to do the process. Now let's, I want to do KTMH programming for this MAN commercial ECM. So in this ECU, now I need to give a power connections for supply, ground, ignition, can low, can high, GPT-0 and GPT-1. If you finish that much connection means, that's all about KTM inch connection. So let's see with the wiring diagram in the software. Now I want to open the software. In this software only, the all wiring diagrams they're given here only. Click on this wiring bench diagram. Now I need to search the hardware like EDC 17C40, CV42. So in this CV42 means here only they clearly mention it's for the commercial man truck. I'm just dragging and dropping for the desktop. Click on close, open this main image. By using this image, it's very clean and clear. This is a socket A, this is socket B. I want to give a cover power connections for number one for 12 volts. And number two for ground. And next, I want to give a connection for can low, can high. Next, I want to give a ignition power supply. So here the socket, a total connection is finished. Now I want to give a connection for C socket GPT 0 and GPT 1 let's I want to start with GPT 0 this is GPT 0 done so this pin number is 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 24 that's all next I want to give a connection for GPT 0 and the last one that's all about the connection now I am closing this image let's open PCM flash so this is one of the main software what we are going to use for to do read and write for the ECU. So this is the main software of PCM flash. Click on identify. Click on yes. So the security pass is done successful. Now the hardware what we are having a man commercial vehicle it's only having issue with the software. So now I want to select the file for first with flash. Because it is detected with the trico number is TC1797. I need to set the same trico number here for flash. I already having a data on the desktop. Select that one and go for flash. Click on write. Click on OK. Checksums will be auto corrected. So now the data is dumped successfully. Click OK. And now I want to do for one more thing with EEPROM. Select EEPROM and select for that EEPROM file. This is for EEPROM and click on write. Here that's all about the software related issue from the man commercial vehicle. So it will take hardly just one second of time. That's all. So now I finished all my duty about this man commercial issue. So I am just removing all the hardware what I connected for the vehicle ECU. So that's all about the hardware issue of a man commercial vehicle. So after that I clearly explained how to use the JAL test tool also. If you want more information means please like share and subscribe to my channel. By next week I will going to upload with a new topic. Let me show you how to use this JAL test software right now. So please we need to go for JAL test. In this JAL test application, it's a clear dashboard what we are having for truck segment, bus segment, light commercial segment and manufacturers engines also. 
now i will going to show you with the same example of man commercial truck now i will go for truck segment in this truck segment previously i showed how to do the ktm inch programming so now i will going to select for the man truck only so what we attend that man truck it's a cla 250 model so it's a latest only so if you want to enter for the cla means that series starts from 2007 to 2018 now i will click on that one only here we are having a list of options like edc 17 edc 7 we are having multiple modules so but this vehicle is the latest vehicle so that's why i need to select for edc 17 only so please click on this application and now click on connect now it's opening for the complete dashboard of a software in this software now i will going to minimize the screen of my face now this is fine now in this one first the option is what it's a fault code reading so if the vehicle is facing any related issues means here is a option to scan the vehicle and next here is a one more important thing that is called as fault code clearance next the option is called system data let's see all the things one by one and here the next or fourth option is measurement fifth one is active component test in previous classes and all for all my old students i clearly showed that how to test actuators everything that the same thing here also you can do all the actuator testing for commercial segment using this gel test and next the system check is also available parameter maintenance so this much the complete clear information what they given in the software now the main advantage of this gel test is it comes with system technical data and wiring diagram so if i want to show that wiring diagram means if i just click on this option you can see all the wiring diagram of this vehicle so this vehicle is adc 17 engine type d0834 and 36 series and click okay now it's loading for the entire wiring diagram of a vehicle so the main advantage of this jal test is you will get a clear image about the all wiring diagram of a vehicle so this is what the complete connector of a vehicle so in this one you will get all the list of components what they are present for the vehicle everything you will get the complete list as a step by step information so for this reason only we are highly recommending for all the commercial segment jaltas is a simple tool it's very easy and convenient for all the mechanics and electricians who are working for commercial segment now i am going back if i want to go back means it's a simple thing you need to click on disconnect accept so let's see all the features what we are having in the dashboard the first one is what it's used to read the fault code if you just click on this button means now it will going to read all the fault codes what are going to stored in the vehicle if you want to see the more information about the video means please go for help button so this is called the help button if you click on this button means it will going to show you that more information about the components also please click on this button now this is what the ems what we are having for the commercial segment of man cla 250 model so this is what the ecu and its coupler comes with a two two sockets in single holder two two sockets in another holder so that the name is called as a b c and d also now i am closing this one next i am going back if you are having any failure with the injectors also means you can go with the help button so these all the options what we are having in the read trouble code now this is what the one more important option it is used to clear the fault code so what we are having for the same for car segment and bike segment along with the commercial segment the read trouble code and clear trouble code is a common for all the vehicles if you just click on this clear fault code means click on accept it will going to clear the complete fault code of a vehicle now i am going back so next i will go for the system data let's open system data what all the content they given in system data let's see so they just give for ecm data and the diesel particle filter i think these all the some resetting functions they given in the software next measurements these all the some measurements they given for the system i think if i select for the first one means what all the comes let's see the measurement system for i think these all the complete live data what we are having in the same car that is what the same content they given here also for the commercial segment i'm going back i'm going back and actual to components these are what we have done for the cars that's the same dashboard for the commercial segment you can check egr you can check turbo actuator you can check the exhaust gas recirculation eg every components that given in the actual testing only i am going back next system check the next option is system check if i open system check means 
here they give all the system check like injector buzzer everything they given engine misfiring detection complete coal and pump rest of the things they given all the features one by one and clear content i am going back next go for the system check in the system check they give complete system check for all the components in the engine management next i going back here are the parameters parameters means what are the parameter they given for the vehicle means just for only injector coding you can directly do the injector coding here only so if i click on read injector code means it is just showing that the injector code why it's shuffling means all this software in the simulation mode that's why it is always varying as per the number so if you just connect for the vehicle means definitely it will show the different 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 reading for the all injectors what they fitted for the vehicle so right now already you know for the car injector coding cars comes with the three to four types of injectors that maybe one is come from the bosch or maybe continental or maybe denso or maybe other bed so this what we are having in the commercial segments also that's the same injector coding what you did for the car here also the same job i'm going back i'm going back and the last option is called maintenance so in the car we are having special functions like this the same they given here also in the name of measurements i'm going back and the data recorder this is one of the most important how we will going to store all the data here is a one of the simple example how they given for the to store all the information about the vehicle like live data or fault code whatever it may be you can have a simple step to record all the data that is called data recorder in this by using data recorder you can store all the complete live data fault code or clearance of fault code system data measurement whatever the things you can store in single option now i am going back now let's see what all the features they given for the next segment vehicle in the bus category so i am going for the home screen next shall we go for the bus segment in this bus segment we i will going to select with one vehicle called as ashoka leland so i'm just clicking on this ashoka leland in this ashoka leland i'm having one of the bus like winger the last one that winger is called the bs6 segment in this bs6 segment winger it also comes with bosch issues if i going to click on that means click on connect by using this we will going to read the fault code clear the fault code system data operation measurements actuator components parameters data record the same thing what you got in the man truck that the same dashboard you will get for the bus segment also that same what all job it was done for the man truck the same job it can do for the bus segment also so it is not a big work all are having same features same options i am going back next if i go for the light commercial segment means in this light commercial segment vehicles also for example if i get any one of the vehicle like mahindra if i click on mahindra means the main brand of the vehicle of mahindra is only the bolero if i select for the latest or old whatever it may be everything they listed here only i will going to select for the bs6 segment in this bs6 segment i am getting a one of the issue that is called electronic diesel computer with common rail i am selecting this one click on connect so here you will get all the information about the read fault code clear fault code system data measurement parameter and data recorder it's also just like same option what we are getting for the light commercial segment but the one more important parameter what i want to explain means this jal test is also covering for off road heavy vehicles also let's see all these things one by one i will just take one example like jcb now i am going for the home screen i don't want to save this report exit so in this one if you go for the heavy equipments like jcb if you just search here like jcb you will get a brand of jcb for example x series 220 model if you click on that means go for the engine management if you click on that engine management means you will going to get a complete information about the read trouble code clear trouble code system data all the functions what you got the vehicle everything you will get in the same this is how the entire fuel system of a vehicle in this one if you want to see the wiring diagram means you can click on diagram also you will get all the wiring diagram of that vehicle also in the single dashboard if you want that means click on okay so now it's just loading for the wiring diagram
this is the wiring diagram for the jcb vehicle so if you stuck with uh, dealing of jcb with wiring harness means this is one of the best software you can deal with wiring harness connections maybe rat beta or maybe some of the wires got damaged it is rubbing with body or whatever it may be the problem here is a simple solution you can go into repair by yourself i am going back for the home screen i don't want to save the report exit one more important thing I want to explain means you can do for the stationary engines also. In our Bangalore, we are having lot of industries. In this lot of industries, they definitely going to use a stationary generator. For example, DG, digital generators are called as stationary generators. For example, if I open for the stationary generators means we are having multiple brands like Caterpillar, Cummins, next Isuzu, JCB, John Deere. Ashoka Leyland also, Encher also, lot of companies they release the digital generators in our market. So if I want to open with one example like Cummins generator means click on this one. Next in this one if I want to select any one of the model like B4.5 if you select on B4.5 means for example I am taking in that one if you enter for the diesel engine management means click on this one connect okay you will get all the connection information that is also given in the jal test by the next video i will going to show you that of unboxing of jal test tool what all the components what all the wiring harness and what all the additional features they given in the jal test i will going to show you in the next upcoming video so these are the connections informations they given completely in the jal test complete briefcase only okay so this all the complete basic information what i give for the jal test if you want to see more information about jal test means please visit our office you will get a clear information about jal test and we will going to give a live practical experience of jal test also thank so you. if you want to see all this related information means please follow my video thanks like share and subscribe